All right. Well, last time <clears throat> we discovered that basically this game is uh, Back to the Future, but an early PlayStation RPG take on it. I also discovered that trees with eyeballs are terrifying. Anyway, as a just to clarify for recap purposes, this tree is uh, Jurak, and we planted little baby trees here to help revive them. On uh, ants? No, they're more like a, it's a trent. To clarify, it's more of a trent. Um, but yeah, by in the first game, you were just rebuilding uh, towns, but in the second game, you're repairing the timeline itself. So here's the tree in the future, about 100 years or something. He's still not looking too good. His eyes are closed. Um, yeah, we're sort of playing Ocarina of Time or Back to the Future. TVA. I'm not sure what TVA is. Oh, okay. Hydrate it is. There we go. Hydrated. Anyway, we'll skip that. Oh, I have not. Well, this shows this shows that I only have the the tier one badge as far as um, stuff like that there. I don't I didn't know what the time variance authority was. I can hear the angry screams now. Um, <laughs> anyway. Geostone got. Floor info. I'm a pixie. Yes, this is the floor where we died last time. And I didn't save and I felt like a fool. Alright guys, the blue seal. What was the what was the clear condition? Oh yeah! Okay, I never watched the Loki TV show. Attack and defeat using only items. Pass. I mean, I could. But I doubt there's... Well, I'll give it a shot. But yeah, I never got to watch the Loki show just because uh, that's around the time my subscription for Disney Plus ran out. I'm just not going to force that. That's working out really well, actually. Okay. Actually, I want to address this. Look. Heartthrob Cherry. 
They fixed the name in this game. This version is not a weird translation issue. I am so happy. Ah. <laughs> what was the name before? Flame. I told you I was never going to say what the name was originally. Mm -mm -mm. Nice try, though. I'll just say it indirectly by saying... Uh, let's just say the original translation in the first game only had... It didn't have the heart there. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> it, it didn't have heart on there. So, it was very awkward. It was using the other word as a descriptor for it. I believe we went back and forth with the what kind of... <laughs> what kind of cherry was it? Oh, I... You stupid. And stay down. Hi, Pixie. Hi, Mask. Hi, the Mask. to hope. Anyway, I've been purpled it seems. I kind of appreciate how fast the characters move because I haven't seen a need for a Dran Feather this entire time. And I, for one, welcome our Dranless overlords. chest was what really really Honestly, that was more disappointing than getting a mimic. I don't care if I'm not the only one. I don't care if I'm not the only one opening chests. I still have a complaint about that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I tried. What? <laughs> Hold 
on. Okay, gotta calm myself. Baby taking a nap in another room. <laughs> Did I just swat that back at him? I mean, I'll take it, but I was not expecting that. Let's see, come on, give me the bread. funny oh that totally reminds me this is this battle can wait a minute so in the background I did some experimenting with ideas and was able to develop some new things uh, for in for instance we were doing that barrel belt uh -oh. uh, I was doing that barrel belt combo. well I figured out the missing element for some reason was tree and that gave us energy pack barrel. So if I can get go out and buy some scraps of metal, we can build an upgraded energy pack for the robot. I also looked up another one, I can't remember the exact combo, but to make uh, treads, which I don't think I'm gonna make, but it's another thing. Another item was the trumpet gun. And lastly, a bandit razored or brazzard or whatever they're called. But, uh, yeah, that's the sort of things you can make. Not just robot parts, but also guns and weaponry. Anyway, we don't need to make the trumpet gun because... We can just upgrade this guy to a trumpet gun. Classic gun becomes trumpet gun. A gun made from a trumpet. What will they think of next? And that has different forms, so we're going to get to see where that goes from there. But how's that? the fancy trimmings yeah. sadly we did not get what we wanted but that's okay on the bright side though let's look at that geostone oh sorry no let's let's go get the geostone as i kept calling it I got, that's it. I got lead poisoning from that paint. <laughs> yeah, yay, finally some good food, paint. That's why I was poisoned. And a stick. It was a productive off-camera time. Oh wow, that's actually, those things are quasi-tolerable. Oh, excuse me. It's a big one.
We need to give Steve a voice. I need to research how to make fuel, because I'm pretty certain we could look that up and then know how to make fuel for our guy. I'm not gonna lie, I think the most thing I'm most curious about is, uh, I, th I think this game actually has some, like, spider legs, which honestly just sound like they'd look pretty cool, so I'm curious. progress. I've learned my lesson. Hack and defeat all monsters using only the ride pod. There's a, there's a fork in the road here, which I'm really curious about. Ah, oh, crap. I already messed it up. Wasn't even thinking. Oh, well. I still need the experience. Hey, Mimi. Two Mimis. Oh, wow, this is going to be easy. Like you can't go any further yet. Oh. Healed it at the half? That's crazy. And oh, I can only progress one way during the day and another time during the night. Interesting.
You wonder how Yumo tastes? A good question. Slime taste, none of your business. <laughs> Though, uh, reportedly, apparently, we taste sweet. Can I have some red fuel? Well, I mean, repair path is nice too. Beautiful chill crystal. That's a pretty chill crystal. But that's interesting. There are two exit gates here, depending on what time of day it is. We found it, guys. We've got cheese. Do I have the saw? Of course I don't have the saw. Why would I have the saw? Not looking good. Nope. 
no, no, no. You hang out back there, sir. When you have it, please have it. They don't have it. Maybe you have it, though. The red dots above the health bar? Uh, there are no red dots above the health bar. think okay there's one other possible two other possible enemies okay we're just gonna go see if they're the ones let's see red red dots above the health bar i don't you might be thinking these red dots on the map sometimes they kind of Got it. Bye. Okay, we outy. Okay, do we want to leave by day or by night? I say by day. I love the fact that the two exits are right there. No. Nope. We leave by day for now. No. Oh. Yep, that's the day. But we can't go here because we didn't leave by night. Interesting. We're going to go by night when it's time. For now, we're going to save and head back. Save up, restock, and then go back in. Uh, let's see. Actually, I'm gonna look up something real quick. Good, good. All right. So we're gonna go do some building because we got some parts. love this music more game companies just need to release their music for just general enjoyment boy these geostones have a terrible download rate straw house shed hot Rough wooden fence, bench, cart, wooden bridge. The condition 15 river piece parts placed has made been made clear. Withered tree restored has been made clear. Uh, forest lake restored has been made clear. Gordon resides in Sedane has been made clear. Tailor shop restored. 
Eatery restored. Holly resides. Weapon shop. Malane. Okay. Well, let's see then. Sidane. Oh no, not Sidane. Sindane. Dark Blood 2. Percent Diorama guy. All right, there it is. There we go. So let's make straw house. We need three straw houses. Great ventilation. <laughs> uh, we need trees. should be around here. Should do the trick. One, two, three, five, six, one, two, three, five. Oh, I'm missing one. Okay. okay. We'll just ham them in in these spots. There we go. Straw houses. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, how about the cart? Yeah, I can make a cart. Any other things? No. Nope. Perfect. According to the geostone you brought back this time, we want to bring Jurak back. We need to get someone who knows about trees to immigrate to Sindane. Get someone to immigrate. That's right. There are lots of people living in Palm Brinks, right? We've got to get these people to immigrate out of into the world. That way, the future will develop. Hmm, I see. And so what we need right now is someone who knows about trees, huh? Max, do you know anyone like that? Hmm, someone who knows about trees. Oh, I've got it. Gordon. Gordon? Yeah, he's our gardener. He's an expert on trees. He's perfect. I bet he's in our yard right now, tending to the flowers or something. Really? That's great. Let's go. Okay. Uh, he'll need a house. So 
so I need to go make a house first. But first, I actually want to do this. Just add a feeling. This city must turn into a city. This force must turn into a city. Knock down every tree. No, unfortunately, we went to the future. If you knock down every tree, you, there's still trees for some reason. It's a stubborn forest. Oh well, what are you gonna do? Stubborn forest is stubborn forest. But before we leave, yeah, just like your lawn with the stubborn grass, my lawn with the stubborn grass, exactly. for that one house. It's crazy. Oh well. No one ever said building a better future was easy. Times 20. I don't know why there has to be skulls, but okay. Vacant house. I can actually read it this time. That's kind of amazing. Alright, let's go uh, open up our new Dark Cloud Real Estate Agency. Okay, so it said he'd be in the garden. Where even is Max's house? That's the sheriff. Actually, they never did actually a wheel, a freight train, and RS. I'll have it soon enough. Oops. Actually, I'm gonna go look that up. Gordon of uh, Dark Cloud. just outside of Max's house in the front yard which is in Palm Brinks and up the hill across from the drawbridge oh I didn't know I could go across the drawbridge this changes everything and there's a hydrate <sighs> hydrated I'm gonna have the best kidneys Whoa, that's a color combination. 
the <laughs> hidden ice element. so much to explore. That's a garden. Oh, it's church. It's kind of funny to think that uh, Maximilian here, good old Max, um, he's from a really well-to-do family, and yet he works at the repair shop. Nothing wrong with that, mind you. It's just funny. Hello. Those purple flames. What is this place? I must know. Hey, Max. How come you always look so well? I don't know. Why do you look so not well? What's with that beard? And pant leg thing. I'll just steal photos of everything in here. Figure. Another figure. Nothing. Nothing. Is this cloth? Thank goodness. I've been looking for cloth. to this place I had no idea about. When half the game is just exploring for photo shots. Yeah. Hello, sees purple fire. Time to leave. For me in this book, Mac gets a hunch of something. Clown Robo's attack, Python Parasol. I could have taken a picture of the clown boss's attack. Ah. Oh. Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to be in the middle of a boss fight and be like, hold on, I gotta take a selfie. Oh well. Well, let's get Gordon real quick. Gordon! Oh, Max. You've been moping about a lot lately. I'm taking care of yourself. Something I can do for you. What? You want me to go with you on your adventure? Hmm. I'd like to go with you, but this poor tree isn't doing so well. Taking care of the trees and the flowers my, on this property is my number one priority, you know. If I go off roaming about, I could lose my job. 
I bet some of the holy water that priest Bruno sells to the church would fix this tree. But, as you know, your father and priest Bruno are on bad terms. Dad, what did you do? Your father never... Never give me money to buy holy water from priest Bruno. I'm in a pickle. Well, lucky for you, I have money. And as long as the church isn't going to be giving me a lot of stuff, or as long as they aren't going to charge a lot, it should be okay. like to borrow the power of the gods, then please make a donation to the church. Medusa's tear. Wait. I have... I have holy water. Sorry. <laughs> I have attained the power of God without organized religion. <laughs> Because God is a wonderful, merciful being like that. <laughs> oh, I couldn't have planned that if I tried. Hello, sir. Max. Yes. Have some... Yes, Max, you've done it. Now I can k take care of this tree. Thank you, Max. My work is all taken care of for now. Now I can go with you on your adventure. Oh, and don't mention that holy water to your father. You hear? Gordon, join the party. If you recruit someone else in your venture, that person will get on the train. Partners in time. Nice. All right, well, we've cured that, so we'll go back to town. But we're going to take a quick break here to appease the advertisement agency entities. So we shall do that and get back to this in just a minute. I don't know why you decided you wanted to stand behind me, sir, but that's unnerving. Hmm. Anyway. What? So there's a monster that does funny stuff when it thinks no one's around? Could this be another scoop? Sure. Anyway, we got that guy taken care of. Ooh. Oh, I already had a mailbox. Never mind. Anyway, let's see if we make things. I believe. Uh, what was it? Cloth. Actually, make some pretty cool stuff. Clothing, mostly. But yeah, let's take a look. See, clothing. So the definitely not looked up on the internet uh, research that I've done. Uh, yes, it's coming to me now. I believe. Yeah, you can make uh, some stuff. Junio's like that. 
monster would find if we get it if we get a picture of it yelling we can make different clothing this is weird you know there's something i realized we never took a picture of that i should have thought about hey thanks for the subscribe tychus never took a picture of a ladder Take a picture of cloth. Cloth. Uh, ladder. And a constructor. Shoes. Say cheese. Unfortunately, those are the exact shoes we're wearing. <laughs> we just invented our own shoes. Let's see. go. Here's some we didn't make. Belt. Shield. The moon. Night boots. Say cheese. Well, I made shoes for the girl. So boots are for the girl, shoes are for the him. Interesting. Oh, that's right. There was an item here. I meant to create, but I was saving it for us. It was a ranged attack for our robot friend. It had a rock in it. Post constructor. Cannonball arm too. Yeah, it works. And if we did manhole, old style robot, and post,
construction crystal, silver, ball, scrap, and metal. Mean one to punch. Granted, I want something ranged, but uh, you know. <coughs> what do you do? In order to do that, I would have to have something like stuff way down the line, which I don't have access to. What? And that's a windmill. If I could find a windmill, I'd be in a great spot. Oh well. Oh, fun times with the uh, inventions over. Let's go back. Let's all go to the forest. Let's all go to the forest. Oh, yeah. By the way, sir. Thank you. She just automatically appear. You sell Giorama parts? Odd. Thanks again for being for the prime sub there, Tychus. Let's see. Ah, da -da -da -da. Oh, too far. Da -da 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 -da. There's been a change in the future. Maybe something will happen. Yeah. Let's go see. And then the future. Ooh. Much nicer. How you doing, Jurak? Big nose. Oh, hello. So, you were the ones who woke me. Hmm? Boy, have you been drinking? Somehow I feel like I've slept for a long time. Yeah, death will do that to you. Jurak, we need you to tell us something. Hmm? We need to know about a being called Emperor Griffin. 
We suspect he's a terrible monster who's taken over the forces of darkness. <sighs> he's been playing with reality across the different eras. I don't know what his true goal is, but if we let him keep at it, the whole world may disappear. He even erased you, Jurak, by destroying your origin point. We've got to stop him, or there's no telling what will happen. Jurak, I hear you've been reincarnated many times, but you keep the memories of your ancestors from the distant past. Isn't that right? So somewhere in those vast memories, you should be able to remember everything that's ever happened on this planet. <laughs> you must remember something about Griffin. Who he is, where he is. Please tell us, Jurak, we must know. Mm-hmm. Griffin. Let's see. Dude, focus your eyes in one spot, please. I'm afraid. I don't remember. I'm truly sorry. My memories must not all be back yet, I guess. <sighs> I wonder what I've been doing all this time. I just can't seem to remember. Hey, that's a pretty nifty outfit you've got there, if I do say so myself. Jurek has been revived, but you know, I wonder why I had forgotten about Jurek all this time. Yeah, time time manipulation will cause headaches. Thanks for the loot. I love the fruit of Eden. And potato pie. I just can't seem to remember anything. I guess I just need a little more time. Sure. Sure, bud. Anyway. Mushroom. Actually gives us more invention options, I think. I'm not mistaken. Mushroom. Yeah, mushroom appears in a few different things. Ooh, actually, here's something. Oh, no, never mind. Uh, why do they have to make things look all the same? Uh-huh. There should be something with the mushroom. That gives us access to Hmm. I guess not. Weird. I was certain there was. Uh oh. Yep, back to back to reconstructing the past. But thanks for the mushrooms. <laughs> it's been a change in the future. I just got back, guys. It better not be something stupid like, oh, we forgot to mention the...
it. Oh, he remembers again. Master Jurek! Master Jurek, do you know about the rainbow butterfly? Oh, interesting. Hmm. Let me see. Rainbow butterfly. I've heard of it. It's a very rare monster. But it's not evil at all. That's good. We'd like to meet it if possible. What should we do? They like the free flowers. You will find the butterfly where the Lafresia grows. We just don't get the nose at all. Really? Please tell us where does that flower bloom? Now there, I'm not sure. If they're not in bloom mm. already, you'll have to make them bloom. Make them bloom? Ourselves? Here, I'll give you this. Oh, no, no, I'm, I'm. a few too many sun drops yourself sir where can we get them it's a kind of sap the monster himara produces you'll have to ask a himara hang on ask a monster that's nuts how can we talk to a monster you must think of that yourselves I had a badge box. Why did I get a badge box? When I get a sun drop, first you need to something that will be edible. That will enable you to speak with Yamara. Obtaining this item is connected to Yamara development somehow. Work on your Georama and then check in Jurax Future World. I kinda wish it would just send me back in time once it's done here, but some fencing around yeah. 15 will do chimney hmm
Have the withered tree restored, but I don't know how. That's funny. I think it broke sequence just a little. Oh well. Back into the dungeons we go. Not those dungeons, these dungeons. I'm concerned about this. here again I have a feeling this is the way we want to go this time flow in the dungeons That's how you do fast swaps. Okay, that's good. I don't have to navigate the whole system in. The monster paparazzi. And here we see the wild monster in his natural habitat. Stalking around as a bipedal sort of looking bull pig monster. It's truly hard to tell if this would count as ground beef or pork if you cooked it, but who knows? The world is a vast and amazing place. Hey, it's nighttime. It didn't feel like roaring, so...
Oh, I've got to switch back my uh, ally later. Guys, we have enough experience points, so the next time we make a stop, Steve will be able to speak. I really hope Steve has a Jersey accent in this game. Or a Brooklyn accent. is just going to be the icing on the cake. to raise his defense. What's this? Badge box for collecting badges that transform you into mo- Oh. Okay, that's clever. I was wondering why we had a second badge box. Oh. oh, he's back. Confound it, he's back. <laughs> hey there, how's it going, buddy? It's Happy Clown, present time. Now, which would you like? Which shall it be? The red box or the yellow box? What do you guys say? Red or yellow? Go with yellow then. Very good. Oh, you are. nice! A wind crystal, and it mocks you by telling you what you missed out on. Oh. Nice. A lovely map. I'm excited. I'm actually going to finish another badge, finally. left.
Whoa! Mm. Red pod fuel. Drink water. Become moist. Is that yes, water is important. Gotta get all the water in you. Oh yeah. Well, we almost had a ride pod completion. I think we only had four monsters to go. If I can pick up some ride pod fuel, I'll be great. But... We're gonna have to just hang out here until uh, nighttime anyway. This has ride pod fuel in it, so help me. Okay. Okay. the nice thing. Okay. Gonna be very angry. Looks like we're just gonna have to hang out here until nighttime, so uh Yeah. Well, 
It's night time. I didn't change nothing. And I feel like I'm right on the correct answer, but I bet it's something stupid like, nope, you have to go down the full other path first. Oh well. make some quick stops outside and then get back into it ba -ba -da -ba -da. I have found it the turtle shell hammer which will become frozen tuna frozen tuna will rise again the iron golem will, may have kept it from us in the last game but we shall have it back in this one and no one shall stop us Wow that stuff's expensive. Let's uh, sell some fishing bait. Oh wow, they... Wow, they really reduced the price of fishing bait, didn't they? Oh, I'm sad. Yes, yeah, you can stop holding. By the way, we're not getting rid of this. I found this diamond uh, the other day by sheer accident. And that's going to be upgrading. What's up, typical? Guess what? What, what? What am I guessing? Even the baby in the background is excited. What's going on? of things, haven't they? Oh, you got your first credit score today, typical. Congrats. Welcome to the world of uh, boring adult fis fiscality. Soon you'll get your first tax. all the rest. I will sell you, though. Let's see. That is... Oof. I don't know where all my money's gonna go. I know we were going to have fun with the drill hammer, but, uh, the problem is frozen tuna, frozen tuna is supreme. I had to mention if we really want to upgrade it, frozen tuna can become, ooh, the big bucks hammer. Oh, <laughs> That's not cool at all. It's going to cost you a little bit of everything. So yeah, let's see. Da, 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 da. It'll come with the wealth ability, which will increase gold dropped by enemies when defeated. You find the big bucks hammer in dungeon chests. It cannot be invented nor bought. Okay, guys. We won't keep it forever, but we're going the way of the frozen tuna. Because the frozen tuna 
will become uh, a money-making big bucks hammer. Yeah, no, double digits in thousands for your first card. Yeah, going into the double thousands digits for your first card is not a fun idea. Needs smash, chill, and attack. Yeah, this thing is very weak at the moment. Okay, let's get back into the dungeons. Okay. Now done. Shield. Okay, let's actually ump a dump up some. Uh... Actually, what do you spectrumize into? Flame. Can I spectrumize paint? I can't. Obviously, can't spectrumize that. Why do they do this every time? Something to be spectrumized into attack. Forest D. Guess I'll just have to wallop things and kill it with the hammer. Is that creepy spider lady? have to be here. Why do you have to be all over the place? Without healing. That's it? I'm getting tired of you, Fox Boy.
Okay, man, star. Let's see. Creepy spider later. A brother tale two cents. Oh man, that game made me cry. That game gave me that game made me so sad. You rotten wolf wannabe. Stupid, idiotic little vermin. How dare you. I won't get to level up like one. gonna hang out here behind a corner and shoot you. Go away, ma'am. Why does she curl up like that? That's right, I can fix her. I hope this doesn't count as healing or I'll be a little bit upset. And, uh, yeah, no, that definitely counts as healing. We shan't be touching it. Some gut and a gooey peach. Gunpowder and a gooey peach. What a combo. One is faster, but uh, hmm, there's the fairy saw. The other reason is we need to upgrade this sword. Because this sword becomes. Uh, this sword becomes cutlery. I believe it's the middle one? Website. Yeah, let's see. 5, 14, 27, so it needs frost. Oh, there it is, yeah. Chill, lightning, and scale. It needs five.
fixing that. Then he needs 14 lightning. Which you can't do right now. As if I spectrumize this to get it up to 14. Would require 5 points, which it doesn't have. And then 27 scales. So it's still got some build up to go, but. But it shouldn't be too hard. But yeah, I must say, the guarding properties of that Spider Lady's thorax are quite impressive. I didn't know an exoskeleton could be so sturdy. Also, why did I leave a chest behind? I'm perplexed in my own my own actions. Oh well. Well, I have the fairy thing and all that stuff, so I'll clean this all up and head out to the exit. Looks like we got them all. Phew. Did I get my belt? Did it not give me... It didn't give me this sodding badge because I repaired an item. Are you kidding me? Talk about cheesy. Alright. Zippity doo dah. Oh! There it is! Okay. So you just have to go to the exit. Clear finish with that healing. I got a medal! Save the progress. Uh, hmm. I'm just gonna exit for a second. Just get some restocks. Prepared robot. Okay. Back we go. Because I think once we finish off the last of these uh, particular floors, it'll, uh, let's see. Only Monica's sword actually works for me. What's a white seal mean? Special music. This floor appears to have a white seal on it. You can't restore health or cure abnormal statuses. Ooh. That's not threatening at all. That was the roar! Okay, forget that. I'm not going to do the sword only move. Or get that noise.
Let's see now. Four points. Getting there. <sighs> My weapons are not strong enough to pierce those mech's armor. Got a slicing branch. Wait, this might be it. Roar for me. You roar. No, he can gallop. Okay. Now there's two of them. Not what I meant. I wonder, maybe they only roar at a girl. Hi. Ah, I missed it. No, oh, he did it again. I'm totally leaving. How about that? Your loin of beef, can I have the autograph? I just want a bellow. I just want a widow bellow. Why do I feel the only bellow at Monica? The local zoo pounding my chest. <laughs> yeah! I got it. Okay, now you guys die. What was that? I was hitting the attack button and just decided to no. I, oh, I'm not hitting the attack button. Okay. Punks. Dude.
and thus beef was destroyed by beef was destroyed by turtle. <laughs> mock soup, mock, mock, mock turtle soup. Items. It needs Smash Chill Attack. And it has four points. So it needs one more point, and then we're good. Thing will be strong enough to do what we need. change for another reason. Ow. Honestly, exploding is the worst one in this one. I'm still playing off the first game where it was like, you open a chest and destroy your weapon, it's gone forever. For heaven's sake, stop slapping guns fast. It is a weird sentence, but bear with me. I can tell there are going to be so many people going to be like, you are not playing this well. I can also say, I don't know if this will stay true for the whole game, but at least for now, I appreciate there's only one Geostone on the floor. Looks like we got them all. 
Yeah. someone could remind me. Do we actually heal between floors or do I have to leave the dungeon to heal? Because I know I auto heal if I leave, but do I, do I auto heal between floors? I'm going to save one way or the other. Actually, I need to leave anyway because the robot needs healing. All right, so we'll go to the station real quick. Okay. Well, actually, we're going to save again because we've got the best part ever. Steve should have his voice back now, unless I have to do some other extra step that they didn't explain. Rainbow Falls. Oh, I need to take a picture of this place. Okay, you can't ride ride pod right here. There's a tiny swamp here. There's some kind of mysterious something mysterious about it. There's a huge sprout here. Still needs to be missing something. I'll need the send you for that one. Actually. Nope, not that. Not that either. Okay. Nope. Nope. Maybe not that. But here is fence. No? Really? Okay. Fine, don't. That would. Okay. Well, now it is time officially to go back and just do some building. Torch, wooden gate, fruit tree, water wheel, hill. Elder Jurak revived has been made clear. Ten trees placed. Nose tree and nose tree between eyes. Nose tree near river. Adele resides. Elder Jurak's branch restored. Hmm. Jurek's branch restored. Yeah. Uh, nose tree between ice tree. Where, da, 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 da. Taylor shop. Ten trees placed in question mark. Okay, so I need to restore branches which allow him. Hmm. Funnily enough, one of the branches. Oof. Bump the mic. Silly me. One of the branches is ready to be restored. 
Oh, actually, I need to restore the branch, and those two will be done in no time. Malane. Oh, I have to go to around town. Oh, well. Oh, let's get the blueprints up. Should have around 15. Really? And bundles of hay. Here should be that we're looking for. Need twenty, so I need four hundred gilda. I got that. Oh, that's right, the Howl of Jura actually gave me something I can make. some kind of boot or shoe maybe it's some kind of weapon mm -hmm. not howl of jurak but howl of thing What's it called? It's down here in the specials. It's a G. Gayumo's Yell. Okay, found it. Not nearly as spectacular as I thought. Okay. Cloth, and then chair. Say cheese! Yep, just a cosmetic. Oh well. 
Anyway, let us go build. And hopefully this time. Start with 12 at the moment, and then we'll, we'll place the rest, but this is... little fence to sell some stuff again this is why I'm getting the hammer I am for this character because it'll turn into the big money hammer and then we'll never have to worry about buying crap ever again <laughs> Okay, this is what I got so far. I don't think it's quite enough, but I'll give it a shot. I still need to get people to move in. What? Oh, I see that hydrate. Griffin sure got him good. It's hard to believe Jericho was really gone. That's a scary thought. Gold paint.
I wonder what'll come out of this egg. I don't know, but I wonder what'll happen with that speech bubble. My goodness. It just wiggles everywhere. You know, I just realized I should probably take a picture of Jirak. Hmm. Jirak. <laughs> the seed has been planted and it started to sprout. That was a gift, so don't you let it waste away. Where's your stretch redeem? Man, every time I talk, I look and be stretching. Plus, with no face cam, a stretch redeem is really not going to work. Magic artist paint made from the shell of a golden egg. Yeah, I'm not spectrumizing that. That is clearly hard to get. Uh, can you make you bigger or hat swap? I will see what I can do. shop for short so we need to get Adele and Polly to move in that's right Adele Polly and Melaine right. what a weird idea this game has You want me to go with you? I'm just a woman who bakes bread, but if I can be of any use, I will gladly. Oh, but first I've got something used to delivering to Morton. Would you mind delivering 20 loaves of bread to Morton's shop for me? While you're doing that, I'll pack for the trip. Obtain 20 crunchy. I wonder what they could want with 20 loaves. Uh, who's Morton? Is he that glum-looking fellow? No, he isn't. He's the guy for the item shop. Hello. Oh, you're helping Polly. Great. What'll, what'll I do with 20 loaves? Well, I'm having a cheese fondue party today. In terms of your famous inventions, it's a culinary combination of cheese, bread, and wine. It's mighty good. Everyone eats loaves. That's why I need so much bread. But I didn't want to deliver it here, really. Sorry, Max, but could you take it to my house, could you? You know where it is, don't you? Near the pumpkin field. Thanks. I feel like that was a hint. So I need to have cheese, wine, and bread mixed together. That's clearly a hint. All right.
There's a note. Today's party is canceled because the cheese isn't thick enough. <sighs> My dad treats me like a child. I'm an adult now. I wish he could tell let me be. Um Really? I can't go over there. Certainly not that house. That's aggravating. What a what a hassle. He better have some response to this or I'll be annoyed. Cancelled? What a shame. In that case, I don't need the bread. Can you take it back to Polly for me? Can he be so inconsiderate? Oh well, you have them. Never mind that. Let's get going. So where are we off to? Crunchy bread fully restores health when eaten. How lovely. Well, it's off to the next town. So, uh, yeah. Whoop, 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 whoop. And the last person we'll need is Adele. Get all this sorted out in just a second. I'm gonna take a quick break. Okay, we're back. I apologize. I'd grab a snack. now, Aunt Polly. That one should be from Malane. for the other person. Uh, let's see. Adele. Now, who are Malane and Adele? Malane is weapons person. Adele is a recruitable character. She's the maid in Max's house. Let's go get him.
baby woke up and now he's he's like I want things so I scream. Thankfully he is downstairs so he's not hurt. Not that baby cries aren't okay, but when they start peeking the microphone. Anyway, let's see. I have pictures of bread. I just need pictures of cheese and wine, and I could inventionize, maybe. Maybe I could invent. Not you. Aha. We need no. It's clearly a bottle of wine. <laughs> Fireplace. If there's anything you need, I'll do my best to help you. Leave it to me. I don't know if you can help, but just listen to this. I've spent some 30 years working hard in this house. That's all I do, but my one hobby is reading. There's a really valuable and rare book that's up for auction at the moment. When people are fighting over it. I believe a bid of about a thousand guilder would be enough. But I don't have those kind of funds, and if I were to ask my master, he'd be appalled and I'd probably have to resign. So, you're my only hope. But that's not to say that if you can't help me, I won't help you. Despite what he says, Stuart probably won't help unless you give him a thousand gilda. Oh well, better get some money together. I want to take a picture of that. Fine. Wait. Why is that not worth taking a picture of? I don't understand. Guns. Hello, <laughs> oh, Father. According to Cedric, you've been off, up to off up to something recently. You're good at a lot of things, but on the other hand, you've never seen anything through. So when you ask for help, it's hard for me to take you seriously, just like that. I know why don't you try to build up this trumpet gun to a bell trigger. Think you can do it? I have to bring him a bell trigger. You can build up the weapon you've been given or you can buy a weapon or bring one you find in dungeons. Which one is a bell trigger? Now I'm just curious. Bell trigger. I think it's the top one. Mm, yeah. So it just needs wind and a holy. Wind of 19, holy of 14.
There we go. <laughs> Let's see, there was another invention I was looking I saw. Because we found those rifles. Yeah. I think it was for the robot. A fan rifle. A rifle. Hey, go have some good ramen, typical. I hope to see you back here. Alright, well, rifle hath been added. We'll just mix that stuff in. Take a picture of the wine. It's not that hard. Oh! No, that's Luann. is a thing. Oh well. Now then, where was I? I got so distracted by the so much of everything's. Lamp. Whoa! Dresser. Telescope. Hello. are you? Robot. What did I get? Crap. Photo album. Good to do a little spring cleaning, huh? Typical. Stained glass. Okay, wait. Where is Mo? Okay, Melaine should be around here. It says she works as a. M oh, you mean through these doors I haven't tried yet? I might do it. Man, there's so much stuff I could have been taking pictures of. All that jazz. Hmm. Is this gonna count as mine? No. Look at where. Please just. Mm. 
give me my lane. Oh, wait, not my lane. Adele. Give me Adele. Uh, she has never been able to see a project through to the end, but if she is able to and gets her confidence up, she will join the black someone. She is quite quiet, somewhat withdrawn. Gonna post that food on the internet? Maybe. She works as the maid here, but I haven't seen her. It's all tables. That's just a pot. Ma'am, where are you? Boy, it took a while to find you. Oh, still just a table. Hello, ma'am. I see, I really wish I could help you more than anything, but I don't have any confidence in myself. I always seem to get, you have a pathway and I've never seen anything through. When I was little, I dreamt of becoming a tailor and I tried many times to make something, but I never got it, complete a single garment. If I went with you, I'm sure I'd just get in the way. So sorry, but no. Oh dear, Adele has lost all her confidence. This is no good. Let's get her to try making clothes again. Yes, if I try again this time, magically so maybe I'll believe in myself again. But I don't have the materials I need. Would you be able to get them for me? You need a sturdy cloth thick hide and a hunk of copper. Here, have these. <coughs> Thanks very much. Now I'll try making some clothes. I won't let these go to waste. Where'd you go? Clock, gold store, show window. I already did that one. So many fruits just scattered everywhere. Post constructor rock, or I did that. Adele. 
wait a minute. camera I'd snap a shot of Linda right when she raises her front what how about no what was that nonsense about it's just a chair chair okay light hey, ma'am where, where are you ma'am can I not go through here Confusing. I want to get these two, and I think that'll be a good place to uh, wrap it up. But where is she? Oh, well. I know where the other person is, so we'll go grab her real quick, and then we'll go back to the Malene. Well, then we'll go back to the Ad Adele hunt. saw me at the circus. Pretty cool, right? It's not much. It's just a hobby of mine. She may be from someone in her capacity as a weapon shop. I'm the a proud woman who takes pride in her weapon skill. She will show lend her services. Monica must prove that she too is skilled. You're a Monica, right? I've heard you're not bad with a sword. But swords aren't playthings, you know. You have to think about what's in front of you. If you can build up a sword to level about two levels, then I'll believe you've got talent. Why don't you start with this gladius? It's fine to buy or pick weapons too. Just get a hold of a strong weapon. What sort of weapon is that? It was all just talk? Get out of here. What do you mean it's all just talk? What do you th call that, ma'am? You, ma'am, are quite silly. I guess I'll just have to...
Uh, Melena's a sword master, so she would be worried about her skill. We must show our strength. Develop our swords, eh? Well, that's very stupid. I clearly have a plus two sword. But okay, fine. <clears throat> I'll get the Gladius up to plus two. Then we'll see what goes on from there. Petty woman. So it's not just any sword, it has to be a Gladius sword, specifically. Damn, I have grown weapons. Turn them into brand new weapons. And you're complaining that I don't want to waste time leveling up another sword just to stroke your ego? See if we can find Adele. I mean. Okay, well, I got Adele. Just went back to the same spot she was at, so that helped somewhat. Oh, amulets. It makes cheese. Nice. Skipping. We'll get a little bit of this, see what we get to find. Amulet cheese. Yes. <laughs> My store is now <coughs> open. <coughs> Come in. Don't be shy. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> His nose is a tailor shop. We have some rare monster transforming badges in for the grand opening. You'll buy one, won't you? <laughs> These prices are snot bad. <laughs> we just got in some monster transformation badges. Better get one fast before it's too late. Gift capsule put inside. Put an item inside as a present to a monster. Okay. tell right off the bat gift capsule is going to be the most important thing here trick has been revived what 
What happened? Besides me getting super blued. Max, listen. What? If I use this badge, I can transform into monsters. Mm hmm I can change myself into the Hamara monsters Jurak mentioned. Then we can mix in with them and maybe get our hands on that sun drop we need. Well, you know, if you're a monster that's known to make it. Got it. Nice. Then we'll be able to make the flower bloom. So let's go to the forest floor where the Hamara monsters show up. Okay. Don't make me go to the future. I'm not quite ready yet. Yeah, that's a pretty nifty outfit you got on there if I do so say myself. Okay, so it doesn't matter either way. And this, you can get a sun drop. You know, use your badge to talk to it. Uh huh. Sometimes they sell them in clothing stores. Oh yes. <laughs> There's a clothing store inside my nose. My right nostril still empty. I'm looking for a tent. <laughs> That's not awkward at all. Okay. Well, we know what to do, so I'm gonna go grind for that new level and stuff, and we'll continue once we get to something interesting. Alright. So we're gonna try turning into a... a monster. Sun drops lately. Got so many they're coming out my ears. Take some from me, would ya? Here. They wash their faces? They'll get old. They'll get oily otherwise. Interesting. Sorry, bud. For one, I need to do that. For two. I, I've done something terrible today. But it is interesting, you can turn into a monster. And get stuff from them. That was an interesting voice, too. Get down, sir. Okay, well, back to grinding. Alright. We got it up to plus two, ma'am. You better play nice or I'll be upset. Be my friend. What are you talking about? This is a Gladius plus three! The sword twice. Oh, I 
feel like such a fool. Not get it to plus two, but to build up the sword. I feel like I wasted my time. I could have just been working on this guy. Well, back to the grind. Okay, just gotta, just gotta. Steve, he's returned to us. That took entirely too long, but building up to the kitchen knife. Truly the greatest weapon of all time. Complete with ketchup stain. That doesn't look threatening at all. <laughs> Alrighty. Back to grinding. Okay, how about this time? Do I have it right this time? Be my friend. What's so oh I have to I have to actually build it up, that's right. Wait, what? No. I did build it up. Does it specifically have to be the Gladius? Alright, I might have figured it out. Yeah, good enough hydrate there for you, Flynn. Okay. See, what chapter am I in? I might be jumping tracks, which is impressive. Yeah, okay, I don't have to worry. Okay, I get it now. We just need to bring her a sandbreaker. But she's not needed here uh, until later. So we did all that work for nothing. Well, we did all that work for nothing here. Actually, let's see. Beast and Cyclone. I'll worry about that later. For now, I plan on some. Going to introduce myself to a giant butterfly. And then wrapping up for the day. I know I just saved, but you, you can't help it. Especially with a game like this. Now let's see. Let's go summon this butterfly that Don't don't stop shaming me. I made up for my mistakes, cousin. I see you in the background there. Take care of your baby. I can take away that house key if you keep this up. Alright, let's see. Ten drop.
How big a flower did you make? Flower? It's huge. It's a Lafricia. Well, that's what we were told, yes. That's a La Huge Lafricia. What do you think these are? Are you going to touch it? Ew, don't do that. It's fine, I'm sure. It's twitching. <laughs> Wee! Way ahead of you there, Flame. Way ahead of you. I'm honestly worried about any flower that wiggles like that. These petals are huge. Actually, they're kind of gross. Okay, that is quite beautiful looking. Legendary creature of rainbow butterfly. That's the rainbow butterfly. It's coming. It's not evil, right? <gasps> Out of the blue, what'd we ever do? This is definitely not a boss fight. Because this was a creature that was totally... Why though? Nothing seems to work against the Rainbow Butterfly. You better try coming up with another course of action. The Rainbow Butterfly appeared as soon as the Lafricia bloomed, which means the flower itself may hold a clue to help you defeat the butterfly. is ticking away, you know. That whole cutscene, my health was dying. <coughs> That's just funny. As soon as I... What in the world? Okay, they start flying.
boy. This is... This is very wacky. Hey, Story, welcome. What the? You have to defeat them in a certain order. Think about rainbows. <sighs> Thank you, Kim. Roy G. Biv. I know this. Oh, you fiddle faddle. Get back in there. I imagine the flower smells interesting. Get over here, you purple minutes. Oh, it's her. She was the rainbow, so but you're the ones that stopped me. Thank you. Evil eye, evil eyes, evil eyes. Are you the one that they call Holly? That's right. Holly is the name I went by as a human living among the little folk. So that means you're. Why did you appear to the Furbits in human form? Well, you see, I wanted to thank them. Thank them for what? Originally, I too was a tiny butterfly. Once, when I still wasn't used to flying through the forest, I got caught in a huge spider web. I couldn't get out of the web no matter how much I struggled. So I just took a deep breath and resigned myself to my fate. Just at that moment, some furbit folks came by and released me from the web. I was free. I flapped my wings with all my might and returned to the sky. No. They were waving as I flew off. They had saved my life, you see. My seven saviors. Roy G. Biv. I wonder if that's the name. I wonder if the name of the dwarves is that way too. The years passed. I grew and matured as a rainbow butterfly. Mm -hmm. As a monster, too, I found myself with plenty of magic powers. I used my powers of transformation to assume human form and approach them. I had wanted to give them something as a sign of my gratitude. <laughs> but while I was living among them, I realized that the time I spent with them was more precious than anything. Before I knew it, I found myself wanting to spend the rest of my life as a human. Then why'd you disappear? The Furbits really miss you. Oh, that. There was sort of, um, an accident. A great, dark force from somewhere began to affect me. 
I was a monster after all. And so this force awakened the powers of my original self buried deep within. I came to realize that I could never suppress the dark stirrings in my heart. There was nothing I could do but quietly leave their company. Wow, that's sad. I've been hiding out in these woods, doing all I can to gain control of myself again. Well, we gave you a weird flower with tongues that flap in the air, so that somehow helped. But the dark force got the best of me, and I was just a mindless monster when I attacked you. So that's what happened, huh? I can't go back to my old friends anymore. Would you please give them this letter? Okay, I'll be sure to give it to them. Teal envelope. That is not teal. That's very Perhaps beige. The dark force that controlled me is what you'll be fighting from here on. It's an incredibly fearsome power. You must not lose against it. Please, win back our world. Well, I should be on my way. Goodbye. No need to say goodbye. Just live at a distance. Let's try to get to Jurak. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what was that? Okay. While I'm here. Dang it. I got a picture of the stem. But I bet I need to be up there to get a picture of the top of it. Oh well. I bet there was something pretty good as far as a picture. Hey guys. A letter to be given to the Furbits. Okay, I'm I know there's a future thing. Where are the Furbits? Inside of tree noses. Oh, oh, I remember about Griffin. Oh, yeah, that too. You do? Tell us about him. Griffin does not exist in our time. Eh? He shows up just. A little in the memories of our distant ancestors. Seems he likes flowers. Eh? Huh? Flowers? That's what I remember anyway. I don't quite know the details. 
Why do I have the feeling that there's going to be like the dumb plot twist that Max is Griffin? But Griffin was around in ancient times. He is sending some strong otherworldly powers into the present. He's controlling a lot of things. So Griffin is controlling the monsters in this era from ancient times. Which means his world is that of the distant past. That's right! So Jurak, how far back in the past is Griffin? I don't remember. He can use vast astrological powers. He can see everything that happens in the world. Well, let's go and see him. He doesn't exist anymore. Yes, good idea. But it's not that easy. Huh? Crest's origin point has been erased too. That's not a problem. We have the Carpentarian, right? Let's just revive Crest's origin point as well. Yes, exactly. Crest's origin point is the holy ground of Balance Valley. In the future, a great temple will be built there. That's where all the sages will gather. So that's where Crest will be. Let's get going. reasons that prevent me from staying with all of you. You might already have an idea of what those reasons are. But for me, the time we spent together was truly wonderful. Holly! <laughs> Farewell, everyone. Stay happy and healthy. You will always be my one and only family. Butterfly, it doesn't matter. Holly's just Holly Toss. <laughs> you knew? Of course I knew. I could tell she wasn't human just by her scent. She smelled of the <laughs> she smelled of the freesia. But if Holly chose to approach us as a human, that was perfectly fine too. We don't care so much for outer appearances anyway. I can tell. Oh, sorry. By the way, Monica. What? We want to go with you two on your journey. What do you think? Okay. Really? You want to? Of course. With your help, we'll be able to put the world back to normal in no time. And so, our adventures in the forest came to an end. Holly, the mysterious woman who got lost in the forest, wasn't you, Mother. But for some reason, I wasn't surprised. I always 
always felt you'd be at the end of this journey. <laughs> Just about then, Borneo and the others finished clearing the rock from the tracks so the train could move on again. Which was impressive. We set our sights on Balance Valley. I mean, really impressive if you consider the fact I kept yanking Borneo away to go help us dig around in the forest. Well, you sell gunpowder, so I'll have to remember that. Well, what am I supposed to do? Just... Oh, uh, probably go... Talk. I bet I talked to Cedric. You wanna leave? Yeah! That was ominous. Let's move them out. By the way, I'm going to isolate that uh, crying sound that the dwarves had. That is most assuredly going to become the uh, uh, one of our sound alerts. <laughs> That was, uh, they did well, but it was just too funny. Wow, they even have a station here. Duh. This is Balance Valley Station. <sighs> By the look of things, this valley's been hit as well. Hey, Max! We'll take care of things at this end. You take as long as you need. Thanks, Borneo. More rocks? Go get them, kids. Be careful out there. Okay, I got gotcha. you. There. There are more rocks. Literally every station has rocks. How does that make sense? Oh well, I digress. See, do I need to? Yes, I do. Let's delete those. And, uh, save. Awesome. All right. Well, then I think we will continue next time.